Hello, everyone. I'm meteorologist Mike Mays in the WRL Severe Weather Center with our forecast update for this Wednesday evening. Nights of lights, a small chance for rain as we head through the next few hours, and most of it will be on the light side. Temperatures running in the low 40s, but overnight rain chances will increase. Here are the hour by hour rain chances overnight 60 to 70 percent. The best chance for rain comes tomorrow during the commute with a 90% chance of rain from 5 a.m. through 9 a.m. and then tomorrow afternoon probably won't see any rain. What is going on? Well, we have the upper level energy helping to develop the storm system across the plains. That will initiate rain development across the southeast. It's happening right now. And here is futurecast as we go through the evening. Most of what we see this evening will be on the light side, midnight as well. By 5 a.m., we're seeing rain in the area, and where you see the yellows and the oranges, that's where there's more in the way of moderate to heavy rainfall. And by 7, 8, 9 a.m., we're looking at some heavy rainfall in spots. Now, during the morning, along and east of I-95, there's actually a level one threat for severe weather. If there are any severe thunderstorm warnings, it would be a damaging wind gust we'd have to watch out for. Farther north and west, where you see the pink, that's where there's some freezing rain. We're not going to see any of that around here. Lunchtime, most of the rain pulls out of the area. For the afternoon and evening commute, it will be dry. And then far to the north and west, where you see that blue, that's the Arctic air mass that moves in for Friday, and we will experience a uh, dramatic temperature drop on Friday. So rain becomes likely tonight with lows in the 30s to low 40s, 38 for Raleigh, 40 in Fayetteville, 41 in Clinton. Morning rain is likely, not likely to see rain during the afternoon. Highs could range from 42 at Roxborough to 53 in Raleigh, 64 at Fayette, in Clinton, I should say. So there could be a huge temp temperature spread. Now here are, is a look at temperatures and wind chills for Friday. That Arctic front moves by in the morning. By lunchtime, we expect about 34, 30 by 2 o'clock, 28 by 4, 23 by 6, and 21 by 8 o'clock. Those wind chills with the strong winds and the dipping temperatures will be driven lower and lower throughout the day. So by 4 o'clock, feeling like 14, feeling like 10 at 6, and by 8 o'clock, feeling like 8 degrees. It is going to be extremely cold. It's quite possible we could spend 50 hours at or below freezing starting Friday afternoon, lasting through Sunday afternoon when we get up to about 36. Morning low Christmas Eve is 12, the high 30. Morning low Christmas Day 17, the high 36. And then we probably warm up next week, Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. We're back to about 50 by next Wednesday. That's our forecast for this Wednesday night. Have a good night.